Good morning, good morning, everyone. Happy New Year! And welcome to Morning Inspirations with Pastor Tim. This is the day that the Lord has made, and I will rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. This morning's inspiration is found in the book of Isaiah, chapter 43, verses 18 and 19. Do not remember the former things, nor consider the things of old. Behold, I will do a new thing. Now it shall spring forth. Shall you not know it? I will even make a way in the wilderness and rivers in the desert. The Lord always has greater things in store. He is revealed in the past, but he is always more than the past has revealed. He who sits on the throne said, Behold, I make all things new. These words I say are faithful and true. It's done. It is finished. I am the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. I will give of the fountain of the water of life freely to them who thirst. They who overcome shall inherit all things, and I will be their God, and they shall be my peoples. The pressures of life are loving touches of the Creator's hand as He perfects what He has planned. The motif here means that we can face with confidence the troubles of life even when as here, we are the cause of our own misfortune by our disobedience. God is saying to you today, be encouraged. Forget the difficult, trying, terrible things you've been through. This is a new year and a new season is coming to you. All that you need is resting in God's hand. All has happened was according to his plan. It's a new season. It's a new day, a fresh new anointing is flowing your way. All that has stolen, all that you have lost is being returned to you a hundredfold. You've been tried in the fire, but you're coming out as pure gold. All your debts are canceled and your children walk in victory. It's a season of power and prosperity. It's a new season coming to you and to me. If you believe it and you receive it by faith, come on and give God the praise. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you for joining me today, and I look forward to seeing you again on tomorrow. Have a blessed day.